Hello Virgo, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Virgo, this is your reading for the next five months. Months of August, September, October, November and December. Uh, in this reading, I'll use tarot cards and I'll also use some oracle cards and we'll see what other things that you need to know for the next five months. This is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. In this reading, we'll see what... Uh, I'll pull out tarot cards, two tarot cards per month, and I'll also pull out one oracle card for every single month, okay? Uh, there is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended Virgo, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. If you are interested in personal readings with me, the details of the same are in description box and comment section. So let's get started now. For the month of August, we have Magician, Hangman. For September, we have Seven of Pentacles and the Fool. For October, we have the Sun and Nine of Wands. For November, Six of Wands and Wheel of Fortune. For December, Seven of Wands and Two of Pentacles. I'm pulling out some Oracle cards and let's see what is your advice for all these months. Oh, nice. Wonderful Virgo. So those Zodiac signs which are important are Virgo, another Virgo, Gemini, uh, we have Pisces, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, if the sun, uh, if the sign pops up, all the better, let's not remain fixed on the sign. So let's see what you need to know for the month of August. We have Magician and we have Hanged Man. Hmm. So Virgo, what you need to know. I think so, but the month of August is telling you that you are a very powerful manifester. It's time that you realize how strong your manifestation powers are. You can manifest things really fast as compared to anyone else. Okay. And the time has arrived to realize your true powers. The time, have arri the time has arrived to realize how powerful you are. So rather than just spectator, rather than just an, a confused human being, the time has come to take some action. The time has come to start some trial and error towards your manifestation powers. Okay. And put some efforts in manifesting certain things. Once you start noticing that, yes, you can manifest things real fast in your life. Once you start, uh, uh, once you start observing as to how you can manifest things, Okay, develop that skill, uh, bring some expertise to that skill by constantly practicing your manifestation techniques and see your dreams turning into a reality very soon. Okay, you will surprise yourself in the month of August. That's what I'm getting. Virgo, you're going to surprise yourself. See, when we speak of magician, if you watch this card clearly, okay, the magician has everything. The magician has a cup. He has a pentacle, he has a sword, he's holding a wand in his hand. And then in addition to everything, there is this infinity symbol on his head. Infinity symbol is the horizontal eight. Infinity, that there are infinite possibilities or infinite opportunities are being given to you as a powerful human being to have what you want. Okay. Another advice of this card is because of the fact that this card is so powerful, Never utilize this power for negative things. Because, see, the infinity symbol is it's like a boomerang. It goes around and it comes around. So what you sow, so shall you reap. What goes around, what you send, it will come back to you. If you send positive things, positive things will come back to you. If you send negative things, negative things will come back to you. So you have to be slightly cautious as to for what you are setting the intentions. What are you trying to manifest? Always be cautious when when the magician card pops up because it is very very powerful card never and ever underestimate the power of a magician card okay probably one of the most uh, powerful cards in in the in the tarot deck and magician represents virgo and gemini 
so this is your own card so you are getting in your own element you are being asked to get into your own element you can manifest anything that you want a cup represents emotions love you can manifest love if, if you want pentacle represents money earthly things materialistic things you can manifest that you can manifest energy passion with the want you can manifest communication skills you can manifest clarity with with a sword card you can manifest the intelligence that you want for for getting things done in your life with the swords you have been bestowed with infinite opportunities and infinite possibilities to manifest literally manifest what you want so don't just be a spectator with that hanged man okay take that action towards manifesting whatever you want the month of august is encouraging you to manifest dreams of prosperity the advice card is dreams of prosperity consider your dreams as guidance and solution provided by the god it will help you manifest your dream of prosperity some of you will see dreams in the month of august uh, pay attention to your dreams okay it's very likely that those dreams are giving you certain signs of the upcoming prosperity that is coming towards you okay utilize those signs utilize those dreams to manifest the prosperity in your life okay so use your dreams pay attention to your dreams that you're going to see in the month of august let's move on to the month of september seven of pentacles and the fool i see that you will have a lot of romantic interest many people will show in uh interest in you okay and someone is taking a very very strong leap of faith towards you i mean you will be busy checking out options but then there is someone who is coming towards you and once this person enters in your life you'll forget about rest all the options <laughs> whoever this person is virgo uh they are very loyal very loyal this person is very uh very trustworthy very reliable very caring this person is young looking very young looking but the soul is very old very very old and this person is an adventurous person okay probably this person is also a traveler this person has experienced different uh, cultures different uh, they they probably have lived in different countries for a couple of years okay so the, uh, you might initially think that this person is a nomad because they keep on hopping from one country to another but that was their lifestyle till the time they uh, till the time they will meet you okay they they are moving from one place to another in search of their soulmate and you are their soulmate and once they meet you they they their kind of nomadic life will stop okay you will anchor this person that's what i'm getting okay and even even though you will have options in the month of september i don't see you will you will you'll constantly feel like no this is not the person that i want I mean, you will be happy on one hand that you have so many options, but on other another hand, there will be a slight disappointment initially that you don't have the right person. Despite having so many options, the right person is not there; it's missing. You're looking out for that soul to soul connection, and you're not feeling that soul to soul connection with any of these options. But then this person is coming towards you, this person, the fool, and instantly you will feel that connection with them. it's very likely that this person is a foreign national they they belong to a different culture ethnicity they grew up in a different background let's see what's your advice investment start investing or saving in your bank accounts for future business opportunities it will help you become financially independent and more confident start investing start investing in right kind of resources start saving up your money i'm i'm hearing that there is a big event that is coming up like marriage or we are going to buy a home or something and over there you're going to need some money so start saving up your money for something let's see what is your advice for the month of october we have sun and nine of wands I see that there is a good news related to your career that is coming. Okay? I see that 
some sort of celebration related to your career is happening okay especially if you have leo placements in your chart and there is a career again let me tell you let's not remain fixed on the signs whether you have leo placements or you don't have leo placements okay i see a good news coming towards you related to your career or there is something that will happen which will make you happy and satisfied okay but at the same time also sensing that your career related competitors are increasing okay you will feel that people are trying to compete with you you will feel like uh literally you without any reason people will start competing with you i you will feel you'll sense jealousy from others especially from your work colleagues okay there is some sort of achievement some sort of happiness or there is there is a good news that is certainly coming towards you as far as your career is concerned some sort of liberty as well with the sun card okay but maybe you're going to pay off your loans and uh, at the same time you're getting your promotion so financial independence is increasing and financial growth is happening action time god helps those who help themselves it's not sufficient just to dream of being successful or praying to god you have to take actions as well consistently working on your priorities will give you fruitful results so again this is a time for you to take some action maybe you're trying to chase certain goals you're trying to manifest something in your life don't just expect that god is going to fill up your pocket with something will give you everything on platter if you don't take any kind of action you don't set the intentions you have to set the intentions and universe will catch on those vibrations once you set the intentions so the setting of intentions becomes uh, very strong once you start taking the actions so it is very important for you to take action towards whatever you are trying to manifest towards the success that you want in your life let's see what you need to know for the month of november wheel of fortune and six of wands with the wheel of fortune something is changing for some of you uh, virgo i feel relocation is a strong possibility or uh, there is something important that is changing in your life uh, i mean over here in the advice card we also have job change over here and then we have wheel of fortune maybe people who are doing a 95 job right now maybe you're thinking about quitting and finding something new or maybe quitting it and doing something of your own or maybe hopping from one job to another so some of you for some of your job changes happening for some of you relocation is happening some important ev event is happening because of which a major change is uh, you can anticipate a major change in the month of uh, this, uh, in the month of november wheel of fortune but the change will lead you to fruitful results so embrace that change for some of you by the way for some of you someone from a distance is coming towards you a romantic interest is coming towards you to win your heart someone from a distance i'm getting this message again and again virgo that whoever is coming towards you they possibly are coming towards you i mean i'm talking about romantic interest they're coming towards you from a distance so it is quite likely that this might be online connection you might meet this person online and given the fact that we have so many fire sign cards this person is uh, i i see an online connection you might meet this person online there might be certain differences yeah they are going to be young looking for sure but they are like i told you this person is an old soul they have few friends but trustworthy people trustworthy friends this person is fond of animals by the way they love animals they love pets they they have i'm i'm hearing like they are having four to five dogs and and cats as well this person possibly is a dog animal uh, is a dog person uh or or they this person loves big animals as well like a horse or something like that this person might be having a stud farm stud farm
or might be interested in horse racing. This person has attended a lot of derby, derby horse racing competitions. Hmm. They are, uh, doesn't matter whether this person is a man or a woman, they love cars. They have, uh, I think so this person has some expensive collection of cars. This person is an investor, a venture capitalist, big on money, or they probably work for big firms, big fours. Uh, they're working for a very big uh, financial institution. And if they're working over there, they're probably uh, sitting on a very high position over there. For some of you, some are, uh, you might as well think of going back to school, college, university or learning some sort of a new, a new skill in the month of November. Let's talk about the month of December. We have seven of wands and two of pentacles. You might feel like... You might feel slightly directionless in the month of uh, December. You might feel like every single time you are required to struggle so much for small small things and that might consume a lot of energy that might uh, drain draining of energy might also add to some sort of confusion in your life so you might be confused like I don't know you might feel like I don't know what I'm doing if I'm putting my efforts in a certain direction I'm not very sure about that you will experience that I, I think so you will you will feel low on energy in the month of December okay there I don't know probably if you're staying in a cold country uh, there might be some cough or cold uh, you might get impacted uh, because of that for some time I don't see anything serious over here for, sh for sure okay mm -hmm. but then that might drain your energy that might lower your energy okay and you might feel like I'm not very confident as to what kind of actions I'm taking or even if whatever actions I'm taking even if it is leading to any kind of outcome I'm not very sure about it so the energy what I sense uh, for the month of December is that you will experience low energy you will experience confusion you won't be very sure of your actions you'll go back and forth you'll be like on one once you take the action you will start feeling have I taken the right action You'll consult two to three people after taking the action okay so this might happen in the month of December but then again this is some this is a short phase this is this won't remain for long let's see what are the other messages what is your advice we have ample of abundance whatever you want can be sourced from God he has plenty of prosperity uh, abundance and love for all you to share ample of abundance so if you want abundance if you are trying to manifest prosperity and happiness ask ask it to God or the higher powers the universe whatever you believe in okay the universe has a lot of positive energy the universe has a lot of prosperity all you have to do is ask okay don't show your ego over there all right I hope this resonates Virgo hit like share and subscribe comment down below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Uh, if you are interested in personal readings, the details of the same are in description box and comment section. All right, Virgo, take care, have a great time, and bye bye.